back back at Hard Knock Life at San Diego Comic Con. I am here, fortunately, with the creative team of Monstrous from Image Comics, Marjorie Liu and Sana Takeda. This is a historic moment to have the both of you in the same airspace. <laughs> this is not a, a, a common occurrence. So what is it like finally kind of being together and being in the same place? It is so, so wonderful being with Sana. She is one of my favorite people in the entire world and actually being able to like inhabit Comic-Con with her is a dream come true. Yeah. It's always good to have a buddy at Comic Con. Ah, もう本当にこの空間に皆さんと一緒にいられることを本当に感謝しています。はい、あのもう、うん、もう最高のパートナーと、はい、ここ、はい、もう。<laughs> How many times have you guys actually been together in, in like the same place? It's not many, right? Mm, oh gosh, maybe three or four, maybe three or four times, maybe five, five, six, like not many. It's like right. just a handful. Yeah. Just a handful. Yeah. yeah. So, so uh, what issue are we on with Monstrous now? just wrapped up the first arc and so the trade has just come out right and so we are um, hard at work on the second arc okay yeah and and monstrous is also up for an Eisner award tonight mm -hmm. it's it's critically acclaimed people everyone I talk to love it and I one of the, one of the things about monstrous when we talk about the comic book industry it features strong women of color mm -hmm. right this is something that's really rare unfortunately in comics how have you kind of taken on that charge of being you know you guys are responsible for for one of the few heroic kind of you know, complex women of color main characters in comics. Is that is that a charge you take lightly? I know the answer to this. But. Well, it's definitely not a charge that's taken lightly. You know, right now we are doing our best to tell. Um, we're tell we're we're trying to tell the best story we can, but we are also you know telling a story in which um, women are um, the central focus. Women are taking up space. Women of color you know, are um, being complex, whole human beings and living outside the boxes that so often we see them put inside in a lot of mainstream, um, mainstream culture. And, you know, and this is, this is important. It's important that girls of color see examples and representations of themselves that, um, that are powerful. Women that of, of every color and every, you know, of, of just, every background that are using their voices and are complex human beings. Um, that's, I find that vastly, vastly important. And, and it, it coupled with that powerful story is the gorgeous art by Sana um, that just kind of enhances everything in the story. Mm -hmm. What is it like when, whenever you get new pages in the, I guess, email <laughs> from, from, from Sana, whenever you see these, the, the, your words come to life, what does that feel like? The art that I receive from Sana is so, breathtakingly beautiful that I completely lose my mind like they don't see it I should take pictures of my face my reaction like a reaction shot every time the art comes in through the email because it's just jaw-dropping jaw-dropping and, and Sana what is it like you know getting Marjorie's script what is that process like how do you translate her words into these beautiful images いや、もうあの、それをあの、えー、なんて言うんですかね、こう、なんだろう、迷い、迷うことなく、あの、あ、スムーズに絵にしていけるっていう楽しみがとても毎回あります。はい。So, uh, what she was saying is that uh, as one of her fans, uh, she wanted to see the art of Marjorie. So, what she was saying is that as one of her fans, it's a very big um how do you say uh, uh, an honor to be the first one to read her script. And she, she always enjoy it so much of reading it and uh, um, it's hi yeah and it's, it's like watching a full movie every time she gets one script and so it's it has a lot of depth in it and so trying to put the best effort in, in, 
to make Marguerite's story into an art form without any doubts or any, you know, um, um, extra things or anything else that's right. unnecessary. Right, right. Try to just very, very get a very pure story Yes, yes. Try to put the pure part of her story into an art form. Yeah. Yeah. Well, so, <laughs> like, like I said, uh, Monstrous is, is just a breath of fresh air in the comics industry. So I want to thank you both for, you know, giving us, blessing us with these stories. We are looking forward to more stories. Hopefully there will be many, many more stories, right? Yes. <laughs> many, many. Yes. Um, so congratulations on the Eisner nomination and thank you for talking with us. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. Thank uh, you. So thank you. thanks. Thanks for uh, watching A Hard Knock Life at San Diego Comic-Con. Stay tuned for uh, more interviews with more people and more Comic-Con craziness. Thanks. <laughs>